that righteous anger guide you. Remember? Liar. All right, look. Those we hate, those we love, those we fear. Genova will become anyone to fool her prey. Tifa. Pumpkin. Mom. Dad. Tifa, over here. Come on, this way. Yeah, come play with us.
fighting? Where... Where are we? The live stream? Me too. Not Mabel. Here we go. Okay then. Thanks, you guys. Hey, look. Think Cloud wants to come too? <sighs> Cloud? <laughs> come on. Let's go.
Stay strong, Tifa. You'll make it. But not if you give up. You have to want it. Fight for it. Hard as you can. You need to get up now, Tifa. You can't die here. Too many still depend on you. Tifa! Come back to us, Tifa. We've got a fight to finish. down there. I need you. I'll go get the others. Cloud? You remember how our parents used to tell us that when a person died, their spirit would cross Mount Nebo? Yeah. We all knew it was a story to scare us out of climbing the mountain. 
You believed it, though. I didn't. At least, I had my suspicions. But I buried them. I wanted it to be true so badly. I didn't want to think my mom was just... gone. Plus, Emilio and the others said they'd help me find her, so up the mountain we went. Some help they were. Running off and leaving you out there? Not that I knew about any of that. You don't remember? <laughs> I hit my head pretty hard when I fell off that cliff. I think it messed with my memory. Everything from around that time's a blur. I only knew what the others told me. Didn't even occur to me to question them. What'd they tell you? They said that you egged me on. <laughs> But now I know, that's not what happened at all. When the rest of them ran, you were there for me. You stayed when I needed you most. If that's not a hero, then I don't know what is. I'm no hero. What kind of hero falls off a cliff with the person he's trying to save and pushes him into a pool of Mako? Sometimes, I don't even know who I am. I forget things everyone else remembers just fine. And know things I've got no right knowing. It's like there's different people inside of me. And the worst part is, I can't even tell where they end and I begin. Go on. Soldier cells degrade. I think that's what's happening to me. That I'm... falling apart. That's not going to happen to you. You saved me before. Now it's my turn. Worried. Come on. Sorry. Basically, we got some nasty looking black whispers going up against the planet in the life stream. And these whispers are with Sephiroth, right? Yeah, at least that's how it looked to me while I was in there. And any idea who was winning? Could you tell? The planet, the life stream, us. Well, of course we are. What did you expect? This is the planet we're talking about. Y'all know she's gonna pour her heart and soul into this fight. Just close your eyes and listen. Tell me you can't hear that. Her rallying cry. She knows Sephiroth ain't going down easy, and that she needs others to step up. But we're the only ones who can, don't you see? We need to commit, put our lives on the line to save hers. You in? Yeah. You bet we are. <clears throat> huh? Wow. What have I walked in on? You know, there are places better suited to these kinds of conversations. Like Cosmo Canyon. The home of planetology. It's right around the corner, isn't it? And do they have materia there? Because <laughs> if they do, I am in. Like, all in. <laughs> Since time immemorial. 
It has been a place for both planetary energies and ancient wisdom. Of course we- Say no more! Let's ride, people! Oh. Oh. Wow, Red. What's got you so excited? I grew up there. <laughs> that settles it. We've got ourselves a pilgrimage to make. <laughs> While it won't be an easy trek, this ought to speed things up. A free flyer pilot works out of an old airstrip nearby. He can take you part of the way. Use the south gate and follow the trail. You can't miss it. And I should... <laughs> this here is Spango. He's taking quite a liking to you. Sure he'd be more than happy to give you guys a lift. Thanks, Disney, for everything. The pleasure was all mine. And if you need anything else, just ask around the village. You're better off heading to the airstrip by Chocobo. Got all your stuff? Canyon's pretty far. Be prepared for a long journey. You're better off heading to the airstrip by Chocobo. You know, we should probably take a look at the town notice board. See if there are any jobs for us. Always fancied trying my hand as a merc. No time to dick around. Perish the thought. I just want to pull my weight. Help my pals out when I can. I swear. Hey, well, I think we can do without your kind of help, Miss General Bootlick. Do you still have faith in your heart? Don't forget Trust to try some of our homegrown uh, produce. The way we snuggled up last night, this I must thought be we one made of a big through. famous mushrooms. <laughs> Only I only did that, because I thought you were Marlene. Beautiful color. Don't go make it weird. good enough to eat, and I might just do that. The bang flame. It's spring time, boy. Not really. 
You know that weird black stuff coming out of the reactor? Well, the wind seems to be carrying it all the way over here. I'll admit my shack's never been in the best condition, but look at it. Holes everywhere. Holes so big that would you believe it? All my chickens flew the coop. I plugged up the holes, but beyond that, I'm at wit's end here, let me tell you. Flapping and running around like crazy. How's an old woman like me supposed to catch them all? I can't keep up with a flock of chickens. Oh, it's terrible. Oh, but these two got away. PP and Peep are so easygoing. They stayed right here with me without any urging. But Emily and Pippity and Pippi and Peep, well, they didn't hesitate. Took off like lightning. We don't usually see anything like that around these parts. From that black stuff to those bizarre aeroplanes. I tell you, all this craziness is enough to drive a poor woman mad. The peace and quiet was the only good thing about this place. <laughs> so we just need to catch your chickens, right? Oh, thank you, dearie. Birds, they love the sound of this here clanger. Use it and they'll come out from wherever they're hiding and follow you right back to the coop. My nose should serve us well here. Right. Take it away. Three of them are still in the village. We should start by searching the surrounding area. They're all my darlings. Notice the howling stopped. Wonder what changed. <laughs> Over there. Square one.
Creepy black things are gone. GYC get rid of them? Careful. You want them nice and fat. That way their meat will be all the more delicious. Wait, what? We're gonna eat them? I know it may seem sad, but they're just returning to the planet to be born again. Like go life. Whoa! But what if they use oh. like Find her before the fiends do. Shinra hasn't come down on them yet. 
free flyers couldn't they care less though, and go wherever they please. Good for them. Nobody owns the sky, least of all Shinra. That our man gives him the finger as he flies by. For real? Sounds like my kind of guy. That's a long way back to town. Careful now. here. I need your help to become a true warrior. Please, guide me to greatness. I'm so Tetsu, by the way, with the GYC. Captain's been singing your praises, you know, telling everyone how you turned some state-of-the-art Shinra weaponry into scrap metal. Oh, so you heard about all that? Well, I don't want to brag or anything, but we crushed him. Really? You have to teach me how you did that. Gotta make Zack proud, you know? He's a friend of mine. We grew up together, hung out and stuff. I haven't heard from him since he left the village, though. But I'm sure a soldier like him's pretty busy. We may not be at war, but I bet they've got him traveling all over. To protect the village, of course. We're seeing more monsters these days, and I want to do my part. And, you know... It might also be kind of cool if everyone in the Coalition called me a hero and the Captain gave me a promotion. Or something like that. Sorry, no can do. We're just passing through. Please! I'm begging you! Huh? Wait... Me? I knew as soon as I saw your throwing star. From the moment I laid eyes on you and your weapon, I just had to make you my teacher. Please, train me in your warrior ways. Oh, I don't know. Well, 
since you're such a huge fan, one or two orbs might be enough compensation for my time. You sure you're up for the challenge? Of course! I'll do anything! Hmm. Sweet music to my ears. Okay, new disciple, meet me over there when you're ready. For pain. Don't worry. I am more than ready to receive your wisdom. Hey! Come along, see what you can learn, my second disciple. <laughs> <laughs> My darlings, I'm so relieved you all made it back safe and sound. They appear most pleased to be reunited with you in this place they call home. <laughs> Thank you. They can be a handful, and chasing them really works up the appetite. So allow me to whip you up some of Grandma Kazra's famous grilled chicken. Say good night, Pippoli. Gotta eat. Oh. Did your tummy just rumble? Stay for dinner. I'm always happy to treat my favorite helpers. Such lovely weather today. Truly wonderful. And my darlings are looking quite plump, wouldn't you say? Did your tummy just rumble? Stay for dinner. I'm always happy to treat my favorite helpers. Chocobo's right. Take good care of your Choco Buddies. Don't you worry. The GYC will keep an eye on things. warrior must be able to make a tactical retreat back to her comrades when they need her. Understood, Master. Okay, I'll be waiting right here whenever you're ready to begin the training. First and foremost, a ninja... So let's see how much... After all, a ninja warrior... Understood, Master. Very well. Then with that, let our training begin. I 
hope you're staying focused, my young disciple. Halt, fiend! Please, teach me your ways, master. Ninjas for the trees. Now, strike swift and true! Show me how it's done! Let's be smart. It's on now! Deal with that. Get, Get to it! Check out this shit right here! You've got this! I'm here!
try again. Now, strike swift and true. Show me how it's Beat done. Beat the tank right here. got more in you because that ain't gonna cut it right i'm gonna take a quick look around you rest up for the next round <laughs> think you should focus on stamina not strength 
Yeah, Zack told me the same thing. He used to train here all the time. Called it his secret gym. Of course, it wasn't much of a secret since everyone knew about it. But it sounded cool. Hard to live up to the legacy of a guy like that. Check this out. It was his favorite exercise. Her strength. Her body. And mind. Start. By training. You're behind. <laughs> Not like that. Gotta go deeper. Bend your knees more. Engage your glutes. And your quads. Got it. <sighs> Wherever he is, I hope he's doing good. You cramping up?
about a particularly rare monster. Deep in the forest lurks a fiend so foul... <clears throat> uh, pardon me. So foul, the mere mention of it induces nausea. This noxious pest may be negatively impacting the biome. I suggest you expedite its removal. up all the mooglets for me? Oh, <laughs> 
much for gathering all the Mooglets, Koopo. After Mog and Mag established the very first Moogle Emporium way back when, their seven children went on to open up branches all over the world, Koopo. Oh, I wish my Mooglets would take a page out of their book. Shop to your heart's content, Koopo! So we just talked it over. And we'd like to ask you to train all of us in the art of combat. Our coalition's only as good as its weakest member, so it only makes sense to get stronger together. We're really just passing through. But you could rest here for a while. Hmm. Our services don't come cheap. It'll cost you a million gil. <laughs> That's a pretty steep price, but we could probably manage. What? Oh, and he forgot to mention materia. Preferably the precious kind. That we can't do. <sighs> Look, Sotetsu, they may be good at their jobs, but don't you think they're asking a bit much? We're looking for training, not trouble. <sighs> if you're looking for someone to train you, then look no further. No money or materia required. Well, thanks, Sisne. That'd be great. But what about them? They're veterans of the battlefield and under their tutelage. What? My tutelage not good enough? In case you've forgotten, I've seen my fair share of action. If all of you are serious about upping your game, I'll help you out. In fact, I've been meaning to offer for a while now. Seeing as we're here, well, Sounds good to me. Me too. Well, I thought it was a good idea. Sorry I wasn't able to convince the rest of them. It's just, I felt something when we first met. Almost like fate. And I guess I got a little carried away. Don't sweat it. Then that settles it. Listen up. There's no backing out now, so be warned. I won't go easy. Roger! Roger. Cloud, Yuffie! I know you've got to make a living and all, but you might want to consider lowering your rates. How considerate after you consider paying me! Where's my materia? Three orbs, or two! Two is good! Enough already. You're embarrassing yourself. Just one, dude! I'll be right here if you need anything.
See ya. If you need something else, you know where to find us. have yielded an astounding amount of data, Cloud. Perhaps you would like to use it to develop materia? Needless to say, many hazards await you on the road, so take care. <laughs> 